head over to miniaturemarket.com where they have thousands of board games at discounted prices like Mysterium Park. Mysterium Park is for two to six players, and players are working together to try to figure out who committed the murder and where did it happen. One player plays as the ghost, then they'll know which character or location are innocent and try to let the other players know by giving them creative cards and not talking. All the other players then try to discuss which one they're trying to talk about. After multiple rounds, once all players got it right, they then go to locations and do the same thing over again. If they don't pass all their locations by the end of the sixth round, everyone has lost. But if all the innocent locations are found by the end of the sixth round, you go to a final vision where the ghost is trying to show you which character and which location. If everyone votes for the right one, you all win. If not, you all lose. Hello my friends, it's the Game Boy Geek here. Mysterium Park, and compared to the original Mysterium, is faster to set up. It's faster to play. It's half the price. The plot cards are cool to give yourself codes, uh, clues like code names. They took the fiddly clairvoyance mechanism out. However, on the negative side of things, there's less player count. Uh, you have to wait until all players pass around, so you'll be sitting around a lot more. There's less variability because you have to use all nine cards. There's no way to change the difficulty. There's no tokens to use to track wrong answers. The Final Vision card's not owned by any players, unlike the original, which made it more fun. The Final Vision is open communication, where I like the closed communication in the original. There's no token to reveal the final answer, which which brought a lot of attention to the original. So they did things to make this better, more streamlined, but they also caused a lot more issues than they fixed, and that's Mysterium Park. Lucky Duck Games has launched a brand new online shop and are offering you, my viewers, a special discount. During checkout, use promo code GAMEBOYGEEK10 and you'll save 10% on the price of your games. On the Lucky Ducks Game Shop, you'll find exciting new releases such as Tang Garden, which I recently reviewed, and the link is below, and It's a Wonderful World, as well as award-winning games like Chronicles of Crime, which is one of my favorite cooperative games of all time, and Vikings Gone Wild. So why not visit LuckyDuckGames.com now and find something new to play?